Hey there, YouTube. How you doing? You're with Got That Funk. I hope you're well. Um, just a little update on my life. Nothing major, but um, I, I got laid off at my job uh, at the beginning of September, and then I got another job straight after that, which I got laid off again after a couple of weeks. Um, the closer you get to Christmas in my industry, which is construction, uh, they do try to shed as many jobs as possible coming up for Christmas. It's not unusual. And I would have been able to get another job uh, over the past sort of four weeks if I could have, except for the fact that I'm going away next week. and I'll be gone for two weeks. And everybody who has offered me a job over the past two or three weeks, um, when I told them I'm going away on holiday, they said, oh, well, just give us a call when you come back from your holiday and then we'll give you a job. So I should be in, in good stret, in good state for uh, when I come back uh, from holiday as far as work is concerned. So I'm not really too fussed about, uh, about that. However, not having a job for the past three or four weeks has meant that all the money that I saved up to go to California with, I am now going to ha have spent uh, being staying alive over the past month or so. That's kind of a bummer. So I'm going to California pretty damn skint which is okay because I really don't plan on doing uh, too much with my time there. Mostly what I'm going to be doing is visiting my family and friends, which is going to be absolutely awesome. I have not seen anybody back in California now since 2008. Christmas time was the last time I was back. Uh, my two kids, my daughter and son, went with me at the time, and we're all going again this time, which means that for the first time ever, uh, my mom is going to have all three of her kids in the same place as, at the same time as all four of her grandchildren and all three of her great-grandchildren all in the same place at the same time. So my mom is really, really excited and I am over the moon to be able to finally see my mom again after this long, long time. Seven years is the longest I've ever gone in my whole entire life without seeing my mom. So for me, it's a pretty big deal. And... Uh, to say I'm looking forward to it is an understatement. I also know for a fact that uh, when I get to California, both my friends from California and my family are going to work on me hard to try to get me to move back to America. And uh, I, I seriously think uh, making such a decision is incredibly unlikely for me to do. Uh, having said that, you know, I, I wouldn't rule out being persuaded, but uh, I can't imagine what anybody could say that would tempt me. I mean, maybe if I got offered a job on the radio, that might do it. Um, I don't see that happening really, although I am hooking up with one of my old radio buddies, so you never know. Anyway, um, yeah, on, on, on Halloween night, I'm going out to, in Santa Rosa, my hometown where I come from. I'm going out with uh, my ex-girlfriend and her husband and uh, my two kids, and we're going to have a raucous time on the town. Um, I think I'm going to be dressed up as a pimp, most likely. Uh, Joel has a few costumes he's going to let me borrow from, and I think the pimp is probably closest to my personality, so that's probably the one I'm going to opt for. But you never know, I might be a doctor, or a pirate, or something else. I'm not really sure what I'm going to be for Halloween this year. Uh, but a pimp is, I'm leaning toward pimp, I have to say. The following day, hangovers notwithstanding, I'm having a whole bunch of friends and uh, uh, come over and visit, rather than have spend me spend two weeks darting back and forth visiting everybody. I've decided to have everybody come to me on, on one day and that way I can visit with everybody at the same time. And I've got friends coming all the way down from Washington State to California just to visit because it's been such a long time. I haven't seen those friends since the middle of the 90s. Some of the friends I'm going to be seeing on, on the 1st of November I haven't seen since my bachelor party in 1989. So it's been a long time. And it's really, really comforting and gratifying to know that uh, the bonds that you make in your life, uh, the ones that remain strong, uh, it becomes pretty obvious to you over time. And, and you know, the Internet certainly helps that. You know, I, I am still friends with an awful lot of people I used to know in California on Facebook. Uh, but the fact is, um, you know, you can only accomplish so much. Friendship means something different uh, over long distances on the Internet. But I'm extremely grateful to know that the bonds I built up as a young man have endured all these years. So yeah, anyway, uh, like I say, I don't really anticipate uh, being persuaded to move back to California, but um, I know they're going to go to work on me. I know they are. Um, so watch this space. I will be taking my laptop with me on holiday, so even though I will be away, I'll still be making videos and publishing them on this channel. I'm also going to be publishing on The Breakfast Club. Uh, my next Breakfast Club video, my normal day is on Thursday, but because I'll be flying to California on Thursday, 
Uh, my next Breakfast Club video will be on Wednesday next week, and then I'll be back on Thursdays so the week after that. All right, I want to thank you for watching this video. I know you all wish me the best, and I'm grateful for that. And I'll see you again soon. Until next time, may the funk be with you always.